Hi there, it's Sam from poodles.co.uk. Thank you very much for joining me today and thank you for joining me in Poodles Advent Countdown. These are 24 projects that are coming out to you two a week all the way through and into December, all focusing on Christmassy stuff. And this is this one. This is this week's project. It actually happens to be my customer thank you gift to everybody who came shopping with me in September and over to one side. I'm at the point in time I'm filming, I haven't finished, so I've re I've got everything punched and scored because yes it uses the envelope punch board so there's a, that's actually two packs of the um, this Christmas paper which is in the annual catalogue and there's 24 sheets and then I've got all my bells which are going to go on the top oh look there's more of them done all my bells I'm just waiting to punch all of those out they're already stamped um, some of which have already been punched out there there's a whole wadge of them and I'm going to assemble them all so yeah this is what I do I, I kind of run this around the house um, so if I'm watching TV one night I'll sit and punch or score or what have you so you need a piece of paper that's 4 by 4 inches which is 10 by 10 centimetres of course you need your envelope punch board and line it up to the 2 inch mark which is 5 centimetres punch, score and then use this line to follow round and keep going round punching and scoring and actually because it's a, a sheet of paper that's 4 by 4 you're actually punching and scoring at 2 inches all the way round um, you can come along and round off the corners at the top of it is a little corner punch I decided not to simply because there are lots of them but it doesn't take away from the look whether you do or don't quite simple okay so let's pop that off to one side so I'm going to put my chocolates in there in a minute and I've got garden green and cherry cobbler because that's the colours that are in the background there and I've got the matching ink so that's my garden green oh helps if I get the stamp set out I did have it oh it's underneath my punch board <laughs> seasonal bells now this is on a bundle with the bell punch and this is the one I went with which is lovely but I actually kind of like that one as well but we'll go with the one I went with before and what block should I grab which one's this one this is a B block so garden green onto garden green and all you do is you just stamp a load as you can see from my, my other ones you just stamp a load and punch them out so I've just cleaned off my stamp off to one side and it's such a pretty stamp set let me bring it back in also you can admire it while I'm stamping it's gorgeous isn't it love the swirls and another one there cleaning that one up as well they're just so pretty I love the bells um, but actually you can see I've got Mr and Mrs and best wishes at, let me read that best wishes as the bed, wedding bells ring oh so it's not just for not just for Christmas it's great for weddings as well actually when I used to work as a me wedding makeup artist my, my busiest season I mean in the summer I would do weddings that were uh, Fridays and Saturdays and very occasionally midweek but around Christmas and New Year, I would do them back to back any old day of the week. And one particular year, I did seven in five days. Nuts. So yeah, Christmas is definitely a very popular time of year for weddings. Okay. So a couple of those in there, and they're sitting sideways. I'm going to run some adhesive down these parts, the left and right hand side. Um, or the top and bottom after you've turned it round. So I'm going to fold that bit up. And that bit of adhesive I put there is going to line up with here. And the same over there. And I'm not closing that because obviously I want you to get the treats out. But I've got some baker's twine. I had some baker's twine. Where is it? Uh, lost it. And it's a trio. Let me bring all three of them. Because I put it back. So that's two. There's the third one. There's the third one in garden green. And they're lovely. They are from the, the winter catalogue, but they work perfectly with this. So, I'm going to go with the gold this time. And it's up to you whether you go around once or twice or, or what have you. I'm, I'm literally just tying a knot. A very loose knot, apparently. That's okay, we'll sort that out in a minute. A couple of mini glue dots for the bells. And I'm just going at the top because I don't want to seal up the package but I do want it to hold down so one on there and 
and one on there and that, oh it's slipped a bit, that is my little thank you gift and they, when they're finished they're going to be gorgeous because they've got so many different patterns, how lush are they? gorgeous the other side less Christmassy so I've not gone with the other side I wanted to go with a really Christmassy finish so can't wait to get on with those but anyway thank you ever so much for joining me and thank you to everybody who comes shopping with me I'm totally humbled um, that so many of you from all five of the of the European countries come shopping with me so I have lots of people who are based in the UK but I send out um, a big bag full of customer thank yous um, to people who come shopping with me in, from Germany, France, Austria and Holland as well. So, yeah, it doesn't matter where you are. I'm going to put something in the post. Anyway, thank you ever so much for joining me. Hope to speak to you soon.